WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished down 214. NASDAQ was off one. Uh, NAS, Dow was down 96. NASDAQ was down 214. S&P is off 22. Gold. Gold contract up $17.40, uh, trading at 1939 an ounce. You get silver up 11 cents, $25.30 an ounce. Light sweet crude off two bucks. 108. It hit 116 uh, and change, folks. The ABC structure was 117. So that's going to have to build some more cars for higher price. Notes and bonds. The 10-year note up six ticks, trading 127.15. The 30-year up five at 156.21 in King Dollar. King Dollar up uh, 368 ticks, trading 97.753. Euro is 110. Yen is at 115.44. And the British pounds at 133 to 1 US dollar. We get open, we take a look at the SPY. What you're going to see out here, folks, is that we've closed down. But what you actually did, you got the higher price. And the bottom line is that you had lighter volume. This is a classic, you know, counter trend bounce. Bottom line, the SPY reached 441 today, only had 98 million shares. We take a look at this. Yesterday, you had 117 million. Bottom line. Um, I, now, what I expect out here tomorrow is that you're still going to have, you know, basically a sideways to a slightly higher market. You know, next week, guess what? I expect we're going downtown once again. And why? Because that window addressing is over tomorrow, folks. We take a look at the NDX 100, same type of setup. The uh, three Qs, yesterday we did the 70 million shares, today you did 68. You did get to a higher high, though, and bottom line, it gave it up. You were at 350, we're only at 342. Gold, gold contract is building cars for higher price. You know, had the, uh, we did 169,000 contracts out here today. We had uh, trading up $18. That's an inside day in the gold market, though. That's the bottom line. You know, the spike high. Uh, bottom line, my take is that gold's going to go after its all-time highs. That's on the generic chart. It's about 2063, and I expect more than likely we're going to have an ABC structure in the way up. Because when you take a look at the inflation that we have, period, um, it's not a stretch that gold will be running 2,500. It's gold. Listen, gold catches up. It's done it forever. The bottom line is that you know, if you're in the gold market, you know, in the 1930s, an ounce of gold would buy a suit. Guess what? And that's a good suit, of course, 1930s. Bottom line right now, that's what you got. You're at 1940. You want, you want a good suit? Guess what? You know, 1940s, then that's, I suspect you, you probably got to pay more than that for an Armani or something like that. Stay right there. No, it's, no it's, this is, that's right. This is the update. Have a great night. Have a safe night, folks. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning, 9 o'clock. He kicks us off. Have a great one, folks. Sharpening.